You want to know what the number one problem that all coaches, entrepreneurs, uh, creatives that they struggle with, even uh, B2B businesses, how to get more leads. And then once you have those leads, how do you turn them into raving clients? Well, follow along. I'm going to show you this super easy but powerful three-step process that's going to change your life. Are you ready? All right, let me shrink shrink this down just a little bit here. And this is what I call the magic lead formula for coaches, entrepreneurs, and anybody else that's trying to make money online. So here is the deal. The biggest issue of not being able to find your perfect person your perfect lead is you're not identifying what I call that bleeding neck problem, the big problem. All right. So many of the coaches that I work with, they, you know, they come up with kind of like nebulous stuff, things that uh, pie in the sky. I'll help you uh, feel better, um, have the confidence things that yes, people want it, but if you had to go to the bank and get a loan for that thing, how well could you describe it? In order to get the attention of your people, you have to call out that number one big problem, that bleeding neck problem that they're struggling with. And because you're a creative, guess what? You know how to diagnose, you know how to dig deep and say, okay, what you really need is X, Y, Z, but they're not listening to that. So perfect solution. If somebody has a back problem and they are in pain, they know that they knew they need to do uh, core strengthening. They need to maybe sign up for Pilates. They need to learn to lift things, but at that moment, they don't care. They just want their pain to stop. Are you, are you following me? So when you are building out your program, when you're talking about it, can you identify one big problem? And here's another secret. Actually, the smaller that problem you can uh, solve for them initially, guess what? Then they become a raving fan because it's like, this person was a genius. If they could do this, what else do they have for me? So that's the, the number one um, thing you need to focus on. And then once you identified that big problem, you have to show them what I call the promise land. All right. So help them visualize what their life is going to look like once that big problem is solved. <clears throat> got another little secret for you. So lean closer. The promised land is literally the reverse of the big problem. Now let that sink in just for a minute and let me give you an example. So that person that's struggling with back pain, they can hardly get out of bed in the morning. It hurts to breathe. What is the promised land? Just flip the script. Imagine getting out of the bed without that back pain. Imagine being able to take those deep breaths and not have any back pain at all. I recently went through some back pain so I can relate to this. So do you see how people are focused on that problem and now you're telling them this is what it's going to look like when it's solved? Are you with me? Are you tracking me? Good. And then the third thing is the framework. Build your business around a solid framework and it does a couple of things for you. One, people coming to you instead of this pie in the sky, work with me, we're going to spend uh, three months together, you'll get uh, all these coaching uh, times with me. Instead of that, how about each week that we come together, you will have a specific agenda, you will have checklists. And the first week, what we're going to do is identify your ideal market. The second week, what we're going to do is to identify the top 10 problems. The third week, we're going to take the number one problem, build out your juicy lead magnet. Week number four, so do you get the drift here? That framework is so clear. People are like, yeah, 
That makes sense. I can do that. And because you're demonstrating that you are the expert, they want to step closer and learn more. So just as a recap, the magic lead formula that you should be using in your business is identify the big problem. Okay, so that's number one. Spell out the promised land so they can see themselves there. Build your framework. It's kind of hard to use my mouse here. Build your framework so they can see step by step what it's going to be like when they work with you. And once you do that, guess what? You're going to have leads on demand and they're going to come running to you. This is exactly how I help my perfect future client. I dig into all of your IP, all of that great stuff around floating around here, and we figure out what is that one thing that you can help your ideal people with, and then we build all the systems around it, and we get to the end gate where, guess what? You've got people raising their hand running towards you. If you want to know more details about that program, uh, check out the links below, and I hope Hope you enjoyed this. Uh, if you're watching this on YouTube, hey, give me a thumbs up, a like, subscribe, whatever it is. And I will see you in the next video. Take care.